Today we're going to design and print a mount that puts our camera on the Robo 3D printer. This is using an old camera I've had for maybe about 10 years, capable of doing time-lapse pictures. So we're doing this in Fusion 360. Here I am modeling the mount. There's a pocket for the camera to fit into, and it just uses that hole that all, all cameras have. It. It's a quarter 20 threaded hole. It's going to wedge right into the tapered pocket there. And on the other side, it's going to clip onto the bed of the 3D printer. The idea is it's just going to clip into place without using any fasteners, and it ended up working great. It does not shake or rattle or anything. It's got plenty of rigidity, and uh, you can see here it's moving with the bed, which means that time-lapse pictures are going to come out without being blurry since the camera is moving with the part as the printer is making it. And uh, you can see here it's working good. We're uh, doing a sample part, which is a uh, mount to hang my Decapitator 5000. Uh, you can see the end result of the camera in place. Looks like everything is steady. It's not shaking. I'm pretty happy with the time-lapse picture. That part didn't work, so here I am making another one. But some settings changed. This one I actually was able to get the uh, support material off. You can see the before and after. I got it on the second shot and there you can see it in action. Hanging the Decapitator 5000 ready to uh, take on any zombies that might try and come in my room.